Hi everyone, it's Mike Levin from MikeLevinSEO.com and we are working on getting a GData object that we can work with for stepping through a spreadsheet. And at this point we've imported GData which is a huge grab bag of stuff and we need to use the spreadsheet service. So I am going to occasionally pause while I go research stuff. And let's see if it's the programmatic login. Let's see if we're getting ourselves logged in. Oh, login is not even occurring. Let's make sure that it is the login that it's tripping up on. Yep, it's the login. In researching this, I'm finding that it might actually be related to the fact that GData is not supported under Python 3.x and I'm using a, a forked version of GData. Once I'm using a forked version, I might as well expand my search and down here it says for people using the Spreadsheet API, a much better library is available at this location. Some people have some uh, dissenting opinions, but it looks really good. And most importantly, independent of Google Data Python client library, Python 3 support. And it's specifically for spreadsheets, so I can uninstall the forked G data, get rid of all that heavyweight stuff for all those different Google services and focus right on spreadsheets. And let's see the instructions for installing. You can see I'm right here in GitHub. Some great examples. It's looking good. Pip install G spread. Okay, let's try that. I have seen enough of those errors. Git install gsg spread. Uh, pip install. Do I leave all these things intact? Yeah, I probably do. It's hitting the PyPy repository. Hey, downloading it. This will be an unusual video. This is sort of the car moving forward, backing up, turning a little, moving forward again. If this works, I wonder whether I even keep that whole video on YouTube about installing the forked G data. We now have it available. Almost none of this applies anymore. But we will need our login stuff still. And we find the, uh, the login example. There you go. GC, they're using GC. Gspread.login, that's the important thing. Let's see, I'll use there. Stay compatible with their examples for now. Login username, login password. And now at least this time I know my tests are valid because it's going down the right fork in the logic. So let's see if logging in works. 
Hmm. Oh, GS spread is not defined. Of course, we have to do an import of some sort, don't we? Double check the examples. Yep, there's the import there. Login success. Mm -hmm. Okay, let's just follow their example verbatim. It refers to an exact file name and it's going to open sheet one. This is so much easier than the GData library. So I suppose I have to change my untitled spreadsheet into uh, use this. Okay. And then I've got my example uh, picked up here. And I'll pick up the whole friggin' thing. Let's just go for broke. Copy. Use this. And now, if this magic really works the way it's supposed to, I think what I'd like to do is bring this over to this window. Make this a bit smaller. A little dramatic tension here. Hmm. GC is not defined. Oh, I used the wrong thing here. Watch those variable names. BAM! Success assured. Long way to go for this, but here we have it. Um, thanks for joining me, and it gets really exciting from here. Please subscribe.